Hey guys, before we get started with today's video, I just wanted to say that I take a different approach to editing this video by using music and sound effects of my own personal to tell the story basically. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below and enjoy the video. Hello Brie, welcome to Core Island, your new home. It's been a long time Brie, good to see you again. I can't remember the last time we had a visitor, hehe. <laughs> I trust you had a wonderful journey with Mr. Wataru. Yes, it was safe and comfortable, I'm still not sure what I'll do here. Here it feels like I've done this before, maybe in another life. Um, yeah, it was comfortable. Great, I expect nothing less from Mr. Wataru. He's the best sailor you could ask for. You must be quite tired from the journey. Let's head over to your new place. All right, the floors are done. Oh my, what a coincidence. We just finished patching things up here. Is this a new farmer? That's right, Bree. This is Dinda and Joko. Or is it Dinda? They're the local carpenters. Nice to meet you, Bree. Hello, Bree. It's always exciting to welcome someone new to our little island. Indeed, Bree. This will be your new house. It's a bit run down, but a bit down. Ahem, excuse me, Mayor Connor. Did you just say we did a poor job here? Eh. Ah, no, I mean. Don't worry, I'm just joking. Unfortunately, we could only patch up the roof so it doesn't leak and replace some of the rotten wood. If you want more renovations, you can visit our shop and house in the hillside northeast of here. Joko, we won't charge you for it, but you'll need to gather materials yourself. Once we restore the foundation, you can decorate the house the way you like. We've placed the complete instructions inside your mailbox. Well then, it's about time we head home. See you both around. Take care, Bree, and good luck. As you can see, people are very excited that you're here. Doubly so for Sam. You should pay him a visit once you're more settled in. He's the owner of the general store in town. And that is a field where I'm guessing you'll spend most of your time. bit messy now, but I'm sure you'll take care of it in no time. Once you harvest your crops, you can put them or anything else you have to sell in the shipping bin. I'll ship the content overnight to the appropriate stores in town and you'll receive the funds the following day. I'll be going now so you can get some rest. Oh, since you just got here, you probably haven't bought anything you need for farming yet. Here's a little something from the town to get you started.
You received a watering can, an axe, a scythe, and some random seeds. If you need anything else, I'm at your disposal. Come in. Come to me with problems, questions, some mean sake. Hehe. <laughs> Welcome home, Bree. Hello everyone, today I am starting a new Let's Play in Coral Island. I played this game a little bit off record, off stream, whatever you want to call it, but here we are playing our first official playthrough, so let's get started. Let's check our mail. To repair your house, we'll need you to gather some materials. Please collect 50 wood and 20 stones. After you collect everything, head over to the carpenter store and create an order at the counter. Your house will be repaired the same day. All right, so this is our farm. What I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna clear some things out. You know, get way for our planting of our seeds. Okay, my inventory is full now, so let's plant these seeds. We've already got our first coffer, which is amazing. Let's water these up and let's head over to Sam's general store. And we don't have that much energy, so let's just I'll leave it at that before we use up all of our energy. All right, we just made it over to Sam's general store. Let's head inside, see what this is about. Hey, Bree, I knew you would eventually make your way here. I wanted to personally introduce you to the owner of this store. This is Sam. He's been running this establishment for a while now. Hello, Bree. It's a pleasure to meet you. Welcome to the general store. You'll find most of your farming needs here. Most of the seeds I sell are seasonal, though. It would do you good to keep this in mind. If you need help, just holler. I'll be at the cash register. Well, isn't this nice, Sam? You might finally put a dent in that seed stock of yours. Anyway, before you get going, Bree, your moving in was quite unexpected. I'm sure a lot of people are anxious, well, more like curious to see who the new farmer is. Why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself to folks in town? Meet townies. All right. So we got some new quests at our hands. Starting out, let's learn how to farm. We've already done this, this, this. Now we just need to harvest our first crop. Home sweet home. So what we need to do is get stone. We already have enough wood, so that's fantastic. 50 more stones. That, that'll be easy to grab. New farmer. We need to meet 30 people. Oh my goodness. Wait, there was somebody in there. I'm going to try to talk to as many people as I can. Ben. Mm. Oh, a new face. Feeling really good vibes from you, mate. Maybe our paths cross again. Why wouldn't they cross? We live in the same little town. Let's go see how many people we can meet. Oh, who are you? Hey, you. Lily. Um, yes, hello, Lily. Who are you? I haven't seen you around here before. Are you new? Yes, I'm new. All right. Who's this little guy? Bonbon. Bon. Seems to enjoy the day. Hello, Bonbon. Bon. Oh, who are you sitting down on the bench? Noah. Oh, hey, I have to say you're not what I expected. What does that mean? Oh, no, I didn't mean it in a bad way, but you did. Why would you even say that to me? I heard from the twins who run the inn that a new farmer moved in. I just thought, you know, never mind. You know what, Noah, you better count your days. Butter. You're working? Yuri. Charles. Well, hello to you. Anne. Good day, stranger. Hello. Paul. Emily. Oh, neighbor. Day one. Successful. We met a lot of people today. Let's see what day two brings us. New item alert. Introducing basic bag. It has a total of 20 compartments. That is a whole extra five compartments than basic tool belts. Carry more, do more, worry less. Available now at Sam's Journal Store for 500 coins. We'll definitely be saving up for this because we definitely need it. Let's do some more farm clearing today. You know, I was thinking maybe it's better to allow the little trees to grow up first. So then that way we can have more wood later. But honestly, one of the things I kind of want to do today, guys, is I want to do the home thing. We need to get 20 stone. So I'm just going to go through and collect stone. Hopefully, oh, full again. Oh, snaps. 
We got a geode. Oh my, updated quest. Let's go to the carpenters. Oh wow, we made it to the carpenters. Let's finally upgrade our house. Hello, upgrade. Confirm. Awesome, thank y'all, we're gonna right away. Doko, honey, a slight change of plans. Breeze here with the building materials. Let's head over to the farm and repair Breeze cabin. Look at this man. Wow, that's awesome, Bree. Second day. Let's do it. Woo woo. Dinda? Or is it Dinda or Dinda? Somebody leave it down in the comments below. For now, I'm gonna say Dinda. So sorry if that's wrong. But Dinda and Joko are repairing your house. How are the house upgrades? More comfortable, right? Now move it and help me get your stuff inside, kiddo. thing was really heavy we're finished what do you think Bree? looks brand new thank you no more holes thanks how long is the warranty no more holes thanks i hope you can sleep better now look no more moldy wood we replace all of it we also built a new foundation for the house that means it's strong enough for more furniture now whoa you can start decorating to make things comfier speaking of decoration we have a furniture store in town. Since there are fewer tourists, we don't stock many options anymore. No one's buying, you know? Check it out though. You might see something you like. If you want, we can go there, right? All right, that's enough. You'll scare the kid. Oh, sorry, Bree. I get too excited often there. We love that store. Even got some of my cousins helping out there. It's family business for Feel free to visit when you have time, Bree. It's in the middle of the town, shouldn't be too hard to find. All right, that's all for. Honey, aren't you forgetting something? Oh yeah, the TV. We threw in a free TV for you, Bree, free of charge. It's old and bulky, but it still works perfectly. It gets a good amount of channel too, like the weather. <laughs> well, sometimes you gotta smack it good at a 60 degree angle like this. The channels are very useful. Let the weather report on the weather channel so you can skip watering the crops on rainy days to go fishing or something. I don't know what you like to do, but yeah. Well, you get the idea. There are variety shows too, love them. Some shows have useful tips if you pay close attention to them. I guess that's all for now. See you around, Bree. Thank you. See you, Bree. Don't forget about the furniture store, all right? Hey. <laughs> Your house just got bigger. Did it get bigger? Ooh, we got a big house. Woo. Claim a reward. Oh wait, we only need to meet one more person. At least for that. Only one o'clock, so we still got time. We got time to meet one more person. Let's see. There's a stranger literally right. A bunch of people right. So we'll see if we can just meet a lot of people today, no matter what happens. Was it down this path? Did I go down the wrong path? I definitely would. Oh, well, we'll meet them right here around. Oh, hello. Who are you? Betty, how lovely to see a new face around here. I'll tell you what, Betty, I'm not. Oh, on these gifts, I gotta get five gifts? Do I even have gifts? We need to find some more gifts to give. So we're gonna look for more of those red 
plant. I think it was a tulip. We're gonna look for more tulips. All right, guys, that is gonna do it for day number two. We haven't sold anything yet. We haven't made any money or sold any. Maybe today we can try to doing some of that as well. It's raining, so no harvesting. Hello, Bree. Looking for a new way to pass time, or maybe you want to earn some extra coins while waiting for your crops to grow? When you have time, please visit us at the Beach Shack. We have the perfect welcome gift. Let's go to the Beach Shack, shall we? Well, we don't have to water our plants today, but I doubt the Beach Shack is open right now. Then these Beach Shack. Yeah, it doesn't open until um, up until nine. So I guess what we can do is clear up some more land. We're still looking for tulips to give people. I literally still only have found one. So that's how my time is going, guys. Maybe I should let that grow, like I said. We can get the most amount of wood possible. Right, it's 8.40, so I think what we'll do is we'll head over there right now and see what new things we're about to get for our welcome gift from Sunny. And who else? I forgot their name. Hello, hello, hope I'm not interrupting anything. What, Sunny? We can't do that to the new farmer. Poor thing will get overwhelmed. My inventory's full. We get both items at once. Okay, then we can start with the fishing. Who doesn't like fishing? Maybe it wouldn't be such a bad idea to. Welcome, a new face at last. Bree, isn't it? Jim, Bree is here. Nice to meet ya. Hmm. Pretty met Jim. Nice to finally meet you, Bree. Come and have a seat. We're just discussing your welcome gift. It's fine if you prefer to stand. Gotta keep those leg muscles strong, eh? Eh, eh? Speaking of leg muscles, I have the perfect workout for you. Catching bugs. Sit, sit, Bree. So how's farm life so far? Nothing I can't handle. It's a bit tiring sometimes. I can't say for sure yet. You know, it's only my third day out here. So I can't say for sure yet. Take your time, Bree. Like bugs, we humans also need time to adapt to new. A little debate first, Bree. Which is a better activity? Fishing or fun? An ever exciting bug kit. Eh hey, hey, my wife, the competitive ladybug. Sigh. Fishing is more relaxing. Bug catching does sound fun. Um, I hate to break it to you two. I prefer tilling. Really, it explains why you moved to the farm, actually. Eh. Well, in any case, here's our welcome gift for you. Fishing rod and a bug net. Where is this going to go if my inventory is full? You can sell your catch or don donate it to the museum. Looks like they're going to need it. Good luck. Okay, it was sent to the mailbox. Okay. But I was about to say, let's go to the mailbox then. Ugh. Ugh. Don't talk. He's, oh, there she is. Macy! Macy! Yes. Well, would you look at that? Thank you. All right, let's come in here and see what else. We can give somebody this one. A daffodil. We don't want to give you one. You said that we look funny but not in a mean way. I don't know what people like or people don't like, guys, so you guys might have to help me. Hey you, the item was sent to your mail because your inventory was full. You're welcome, developers. Claiming the gifts. Ooh, okay, we can go fishing now. And we can catch some buggies. We caught our first bug, the snail. Okay guys, honestly, I'm not really seeing much of what to do right now. So we're probably gonna go fishing or bug catching. I was trying to look for some gifts to give people. Which I guess we do have these um, canola seeds. Hola. Got another snail. Woo woo. But um, yeah, I'm really not seeing what there is to do right now. I'm pretty much just running around. Or maybe I don't know if I should clear out more of my farm. Because look at this. I think I want to put this one over here for donation stuff. I know we need to donate stuff. But like, I don't know. I don't know what we need to donate, if that makes sense. So I thought the new update told you what you need to donate, but I don't think I'm far enough into the game yet to quite unlock that. But I want to start selling stuff already, so we can start earning some money. Uh, maybe what we'll do is we'll go fishing for the rest of the day, and we'll come down here to like the beach area. Okay, well, I just came all the way down here 
go fishing. It took me longer to get down here than it did, you know, fish. Oh my god. There's so much resistance on this. Oh, no, no, no. Bull, bull, bull. No! I'm so close! When well, we can't let my first fish go dead. Mackerel had me fighting for my life right now. Okay, my energy is about to like run out too. Is my inventory full? I don't even know. Okay, this must be another mackerel because why is it acting crazy? No! No! No, please! Yes! A frogfish? Whoa, oh my god, I don't even know what that is. Let's do one more fish. We got 13. Um. 13 right here. What is that? Stamina. 13 stamina remaining. It's already 10 o'clock, so. Oh my god. This area right here, these fish. The little scoundrels. We can't. We cannot catch this last fish. Come on. Ugh. Come, yes! Okay, macro again. No! I did not mean to do that. I didn't. I was. Uh. Okay, well, I did not mean to do that. Well, got this too right here. What is a stamp? Harmon, getting started. You discovered a book. Go to the library to read it. That's a book? I thought that was like the Mario stamp. We definitely need a clear path. We're right here. We're literally right here, dude. Are you serious? We're like right here. Okay, come on. Right. We're literally right here. I can literally see everything. We're here though. We made some money today too with our snail. All right, forging plus one skill point plus three max energy. Yes, catching, awesome. Plus one skill point plus three energy max. And let's see, twenty dollars for a snail. Okay, that's good. But I'm gonna end the video off right here today, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. Coral Island episode one. Let me know down in the comments some different things that I should do in the game. And this has been Breezy and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out everybody.